Inflation is showing no signs of slowing down as Americans pay over $1,000 a month more on the same essentials we were buying three years ago. Nothing's changed but price. The latest consumer price index for March showing basic necessities like our food, housing, and gas are all continuing to cripple Americans' wallets with higher prices. Let's bring in News Nation business contributor Gary B. Smith to explain what this means for you and me at home. Uh, Gary, happy Friday to you, my sir, um, my good friend. Inflation keeps taking one step forward we keep taking like two three steps back the problem is our paychecks aren't changing along with it Gary exactly they're if you make the most liberal case Marky they're barely keeping up but a good baseline is not to pick on the president but to use that as a point in time inflations are our, our wages are actually down against inflation since Biden took office. So not only are prices soaring, but you know our wages, at least if you measure hourly wages, are not keeping up at all. And Americans say, you know, specifically with groceries, that it's the grocery prices that are crushing. Uh, who's to blame at this point, Gary? Is it, is it corporate greed or is it inflation? I mean, we know the Federal Trade Commission has asked policymakers to look further into grocery store profits. So who do you point the finger at? It's just like I remember a few years ago when they marched all those oil executives uh, in front of Congress blaming them on the high prices when, you know, just a year or two before and after uh, companies like Exxon were losing a lot of money. It's the same way with grocery stores. Look, they're passing on their prices. It's not greed. It's supply chain. So what are you going to do about grocery prices? Same thing my wife and I have done. Instead of... Um, Beef, you buy chicken. Instead of uh, you know uh, going with uh, Kellogg cereal, you go with the store brand. You instead of you know it's it's kind of like the weather. Everyone complains about it. No one does anything about it. Instead of going to the Publix, it, you, we'd be the high price uh, store around us. You go to the Aldi. So there's ways to address it. But it's going to require a change in people's behavior. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and the leaner meats, uh, leaner on our wallets right now, too. Uh, Gary B. Smith, always good to see you. Thank you so much Thanks, for your time Bucky. this morning. Have a great weekend. Thanks for watching, everybody. Go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your television provider. Also, don't forget to click that red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.